feel free to enjoy your appetizer as I begin tonight's presentation by introducing Tony Artebell. Tony, will you please join me at the podium? Forty years ago, Tony graduated from Penn State with a degree in nursing. Today, she is Chief Executive Officer for Bon Secours Virginia Health System. She is dedicated to serving the community and is focused on issues surrounding the health and well-being of children, particularly the underserved and marginalized. One nominator wrote, Tony is one of the most insightful hospital administrators I have had the opportunity to work with. She is a master at building consensus. For Tony, it is all about the team and the goal. It is about each person and the people. I'm proud to present Tony Artebell with the Alumni Fellow Award. Thank you, President Barron, and I also want to extend my thanks and appreciation to the awards committee for selecting me for this great honor. I want to thank Dr. Paula Malone Nuzzo, Dean of the College of Nursing, and Kevin Still, President of the Penn State Alumni Association. My husband is here with me this evening, and I thank him for his support, and my mother and my late father, who loved and supported me and helped me to arrive at Penn State when my mother gave me the advice, if you want to be a nurse, do it with a BSN. Do not get a diploma. It won't take you where you need to go. It was good advice. It's been a surprising and unexpected honor, and I'm humbled to be among my fellow alumni honorees, many who I got to meet this evening, and I'd like to congratulate all of you on your selection as well as your wonderful accomplishments since graduating from Penn State. I've had such fond memories of my years at Penn State. I really established my foundation for individualism and leadership outside from what my parents taught me. It was on these grounds that I learned many of life's lessons about being the best, being compassionate. I learned about teamwork and perhaps most importantly about humility. The compassion that I learned was actually shared with me from a nursing instructor when one semester I had mono and missed half of my clinicals and she worked in her own time to make sure I made up my clinicals. These were gifts that were role modeled for me and I used early in my career and still use. Perhaps the most profound gift though the Penn State provided me was an open road and the knowledge and courage to take it in whatever direction I choose. And for that, I will be forever grateful. Thank you for this wonderful honor.